An Olmstead County man accused of shooting and killing another man back in May will try and argue his mental illness played a role in that crime. That's according to court documents. 32-year-old William Schillingford is charged with two counts of second-degree murder and one count of second-degree assault. ABC6 News reporter Emily Pofal live in our newsroom right now to help dissect this after speaking with criminal attorneys today. Emily, what did you learn? James, the criminal complaint says Schillingford shot at the victim, 70-year-old John Colbert, three times on May 8th. Police say that Schillingford and Colbert were acquaintances, but they didn't release any information about motive or about Schillingford's state of mind. Schillingford's attorney just notified the state that they plan to argue what's called a mental illness or cognitive impairment defense. This means the defense is alleging that Schillingford was so mentally ill at the time of the crime that he didn't understand the nature of the act or that it was wrong. Some attorneys I spoke with say this can be difficult to prove. James McGinney is a criminal defense attorney in Rochester not working on this case. He says if Schillingford's psych evaluation shows he was mentally ill, there's a chance the case will be settled without a jury trial. In my experience, the case doesn't go to trial once you have that opinion. The, the prosecutors will acknowledge that the offender is mentally ill. McGinney says that the defendant's behavior can help determine whether or not they were mentally ill. So can a defendant's previous mental health and criminal history. James.